Shalom everyone. Hello. Shalom. Welcome to Culture Vaz, Israel, and welcome to Israel. Thank you. Uh, may I ask each of you to introduce yourself? It's me to start. I'm Rainer Wehle. I'm a clarinet player from Germany. I'm, I was a member of different orchestras, I played as a soloist all over the world and a chamber musician. And I'm a teacher since 20 years together with my wife, who is very famous, Sabine Meyer. And we share a professorship in North Germany in Lübeck. And I think for me it's the sixth or seventh time in Israel. I'm, I really enjoy this country and the culture. Thank you. Hello, my name is Caroline Hartig. I am clarinet professor at the Ohio State University in Columbus, Ohio, in the United States. And um, uh, this is my first time to Israel, and it's such a pleasure to be here. I really enjoyed the warmth of all the people, and and, uh, and to learn uh, to know all these people that I've met from all over the world. It's been really a, a great pleasure. Hello, I'm Joy Farrell. Um, I'm Professor of Clarinet at the Guildhall School of Music in London and I'm Principal Clarinet in a chamber orchestra, the Britain Symphonia, and I play in a wind ensemble, the Hafner Wind Ensemble. And my connections with Israel I, I are absolutely through music and through the clarinet because I was a student of Jona Ettlinger many years ago and I was so excited to come back to Israel, to, or to come to Israel I should say, not back but from where he came, but to come to Israel in 2011 for the first time. So this is kind of my second visit and all related to clarinet and the music. So it's very nice for me. I'm Eli Iban, also known in Israel as Evan. Um, uh, I'm a professor of clarinet at uh, Jacob School of Music in Bloomington, Indiana. Uh, however, I grew up in Israel and started my uh, association with the clarinet here, listening to and later on playing in the Israel Philharmonic Orchestra. Um, I've been in the U.S. for 20 years uh, pursuing a solo and teaching career, but I come back often and uh, most often to uh, Sarah Elbaz's clarinet days, such as we have here where it's always a pleasure to meet uh, wonderful, respected colleagues from all over the world. And um, I think it's a wonderful opportunity for our young students to be so connected. So this is a pleasure. I'm Mira Zakai, <coughs> professor of voice at the Buchmann Meta School of Music. And uh, apropos Jona Ettlinger, when he heard me 40 years ago, he told me to go and study voice, not just to sing. So I really am very grateful to him and I have very good memories mm -hmm. of this great man and musician. And I joined the jury as a, how do you say, Yoshevosh? President? Mm, I don't Chairman. Like the Chairman. 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 Chairman of the jury. I'm, I'm not uh, judging, I'm just observing and only, in, and I write my notes for myself, of course, and in case of emergency, if we have a balance or a teko, then I add my voice and I'm very happy to be a member of these wonderful singers <laughs> because they all, we, we all are looking for singing in every, in every instrument and that's what my part of, of the judgment is. So would you tell me a little bit about what you have been seeing in terms of uh, uh, how many people, ages, and what your impressions are of, the, uh, of our young uh, musicians here, clarinet players? Well, we, we've seen, I think, in the, we've seen the, so a junior section, 14 to 18, 18, and we saw maybe eight students there, yes. I think. Yeah, and then we had a senior section, 18 to 26, and we saw 11 students there all together. And they all played a set program to begin with. And then we narrowed it down a bit. Uh, for the youngsters, we, we chose some for the final straight away, so they get the chance to play with the orchestra. And we had a second round in the seniors to where they played completely on their own with no piano, which was mm -hmm. very interesting, very challenging, and they had to play an Israeli piece in there also. Uh, we have been overwhelmed by the commitment to uh, the preparation, uh, the seriousness, the care and attention um, that they have taken, and we have heard a lot of singing. Mm -hmm. It's been yeah. quite remarkable. I was, it was, I don't know what I expected, but I've been 
very impressed with the students and subsequently some organization of it which is fantastic that Sarah has done is now we are for those that didn't make it through it's not the end of the road as our chairman made a lovely speech but we have been seeing them in lessons so so if they didn't make through they then come and see us and they're so keen you know what did you think what did what was it what did I do wrong can you help me with this so it's like the almost the the nicest use of it, to be on a jury, not to just be behind the table, you know, yes, no, yes, no, yes. Now we can meet the students and work with them. Yeah. Wow, yeah, thank you. Any other impressions or additions? I'll echo what Joy said. I'm very impressed and by the heart and soul of the students, how much uh, time and commitment they've put into the music and how much they love to play. And uh, you can just see that they're, they're very well schooled and it's wonderful that, um, you know, uh, Suzanne, uh, thanks to her mo mother, uh, the late Ruth, um, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. um, uh, without her support we wouldn't have this international competition and I think it's just going to grow and grow every, um, I think they're thinking of having it uh, two, in two years again. Mm -hmm. yeah. And what a wonderful opportunity, I know there will be uh, continuing more and more people coming from abroad. Really yeah, Suzanne's mother was an amateur player of clarinet and in fact in Liverpool where they lived uh, she established a, a chamber group of, of players with clarinetists and they had regular concerts and she played all her life till the very end so the father decided to the family decided to, to start this competition which is the first in Israel only for clarinetists and they uh, contributed uh, the first prize, which is a huge, a very, very unusual first prize, $10,000 mm -hmm. wow. for the winners. I mean, even in, on international, mm -hmm. international yeah. level, it's very big. It's a wonderful prize. And that what enabled also the competition to become um, attractive to people from all over the world. And I think that over the years it will be more and more so. I hope so. So um, I want to thank you very much for your time and for coming to Israel. <laughs> and, uh, uh, and in the name of Culture Buzz Israel, <laughs> our team and audience, uh, thank you for uh, sharing these uh, insights with us. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Shalom. 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 Yeah. Thank you.